here I am. My name is Pinocchio. As a kid, I was pulled into show business. All I wanted was to be accepted by society. And I was. More than that, I became a celebrity. Movies, interviews, I got to meet royalty. Pictures of me covered buildings, buses, even those little trees you hang in your car to make it smell good. I was a natural part of everyone's daily life. I was front page news. My ego took over and I loved the glamour's life. But soon, I realized the truth. I only got all this attention because people saw me as a freak show. Because I was made of wood. All the smiles that people greeted me with were just masks. And behind those masks was fear. Once I had understood this, I began to hide. But that just made the media even more curious. Everyone loves a mystery. By a miracle, I met the Blue Fairy. And I became normal. At first, it was worldwide news. But soon, I was forgotten. I was one in the crowd. And it felt so good. I was a real human. And that's the way it has been. Until a few months ago. Here I am, and here's my conscience. He's been with me for as long as I can remember. But during my time as a celebrity, I stopped listening to him. Since then, he's been more absent than present. I would have wanted him by my side when I was considering suicide. But nowadays, when he does show up, he just makes me feel guilty. The past few weeks, I've been going to support group meetings for depression sufferers. There's a meeting every Saturday. I don't say anything, I just listen. Thank you, Joanna. Thank you.
Okay, so... How about you there, in the back? Would you like to say anything? This time? No. No. All right. Ben, would you like to come up? I need to talk to you. I gotta go. I know who you are. Okay, then just please leave me alone. There is a man who can help us. I gotta go. Just like everyone else. No, I'm just like you. My number, okay? Call me. Can take this off? No. But it's warm. No, I'm cold. You're up early. So what does fixing it permanently mean? Give me my phone! There you go. Happy? Now, who the fuck is Wiz? Huh? Tell me! You got your wish, but a wish come true doesn't last forever. 
when are you gonna stop comparing yourself to everyone else and realize that your place in this world is worth something, huh? You've been given a gift. But that gift wasn't to become normal. It was supposed to be the realization that you're not meant to be normal. You're unique. Hello? Okay. Let's do it. Okay. Are you here for business or pleasure? Business? It doesn't matter. Because with business is always a pleasure. <laughs> okay, great. This was in there. Yeah? I need to talk to him. He's with me. Okay. Well, this is a surprise indeed. Please, take a seat. says you can make us human permanently I see that your nose has begun to grow again you didn't like that very much did you <laughs> that must have hurt Ooh. but permanently of course of course although last time she was here she changed her mind very last minute. Ik sent lille halfs voor. Regret is the poison of life. Get it inside of your head and it will kill you, slowly and painfully. But this time, we're doing it. Give us what we want.
What will we owe you? <laughs> it's on the house. Thanks. Hold on. We'll be on our way. Of course, of course. You can leave whenever you want. Just give me a call next time so that I can clean up a bit before you come. There will be no next time. So you said. To the loop. Okay. Wait. What? Maybe we're not meant to be human. What? No such chance. I know, but... But what? Maybe this transformation has been the plan all along. Why? Whose fucking plan? Destiny! Fuck do I know? What I'm trying to say is that maybe... Our true selves should have their place in this world. I am sick and tired of letting other people's opinion on me dictate what I do or don't do. Let's be rebels. Let's show the world who we truly are. And let their reactions only be reflections of themselves. Come on. Come on.